Hey guys, it's Marcus Maka. Welcome back to more Let's Play Legends of the Twilight Princess. In the last part, we took care of some things before heading to... Ooh, hello. Before heading to uh, Telma's bar. Um, first, I wanted to check out something here in the West Gate. And look what I found. One of the poses that that weird dude that I almost called Giovanni when I read when I edited the other day. He's no Giovanni. He said we need to collect 20 of these, um, which we'll be sure to do at one point. Anyways, um, I went and made those donations, and uh, for the next thing that we need to do to get a shop here in, uh, here in Hyrule, a Malamart here in Hyrule, oh, hello, the bridge is fixed, uh, here in uh, Hyrule Town. Um, we need 2,000 rupees. So basically, I need to come there. Like, I that's why I have zero, but like, I finished off and I pay what I had left. I have like 1950 50 or something that I have to do. Do not feel like doing anything. My body feels terrible. I just kind of so well, I really need a shower. So, so get back to really normal. Okay. So I honestly don't want to do that right now because I kind of want to, I've done a lot of extra stuff and I think I've done enough. I want to go to Telma's bar and apparently hit B on a complete accident. Um, and go find out who these new hero people are or whatever. Oh, you... Boom. Although, um, we do need to do that spring water thing because it'll get the guys selling spring water and we need to get that for, um, to clear out the south exit so that way, you know, I mean, I'm never going to use them, but you know, it's good to do it just in case. So, I mean, if I could just warp everywhere, I guess, it'd be no problem. I will have to do one thing and like go and search around for pose. For a while. I know there's like 60 that you need to get in total, but I've only gotten 20. Alright, let's go Telma's bar. Let's make sure I was recording. It didn't look like it was. Alright. Boop. It's a bar. It should be open. <laughs> huh. Hey, Telma. Oh. oh my, if it isn't Link. Hello. You made it, how have you been, honey? Mercy, you've been good timing, I was just talking about you. That's good. Hey everyone, introduce yourselves. This handsome young man is the infamous Link. Cool. Remember what I told you before, honey? These are the friends that I mentioned. One who are trying to help deal with all the troubles on Hyrule. Actually, there's one more of us. Disturbing turn of events of the eastern desert. The Gruda Desert, I think. Old man named Aru. Aru? If you happen to meet him, definitely take the time to talk with him. Okay, honey? Will you come all the way here, honey? Why don't you relax a bit? Sounds like a good idea. Alright, let's go talk to him. Let's talk to this dude. Oh, there you must be Link, correct? I'm Shad. Wonderful to meet you. Talma told me you've been what you've been up to, or all you've been up to. You're rather formidable. I'm rather not, I'm afraid. Well, I'm formidable at a book reading, but I lack, shall we say, physical skills. As said, if the history and legends of Hyrule are your cup of tea, I'm your fellow. If you're curious, just ask away. Alright, what about you? I'm Aishi. Um, here in the mountains with my father, who was a knight in his own right. He taught me the arts of war, thought I was his son. Aren't you a girl? Of course, lots of common courtesy. Are you a girl? Before I blab both of your ears off, I want to tell you something. Snow Peak, the mountain at the North Hyrule, is unlike any mountain I've ever known. Not much about it, but things happen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Evil controls it. As soon as I know something more, I'll tell you. Until then, you should stay away. Are you a girl? There's only one way to know. Yeah, you're a girl. All right. It's been a long time. What? Hey, it's you! It's, uh, it's, uh... I forgot your name! <laughs> Russell, I think? Oh, dude, so long, so long. So long. Okay. 
Oh, it's the cat! Meow! <laughs> What to order? What to order? I believe I'll start with the meats. <laughs> All right. So I want to check this map because I believe we can't go and figure out. All right, there we go. Hi. The old Kadra Lake Helia. Okay, so that's where we need to go. So let's go do that. God, it's like midnight. I'm still recording. Holy crap! I'm not editing tonight. That sure is. That's 100% for sure. I'm uploading tonight, though. Alright. So there's nobody here that can see us. So let's just warp out of here. Head to Lake Ilya. Cool. Alright. Alright. All right, hey. Let's go this way. So, um, I guess since I'm doing some kind of like story, ow, can I like, grab on the ladder? Okay, some stuff. I figured it'd be nice to talk about some things. Um, well, um, I guess we're getting, we're getting. This is episode forty, so we're getting pretty far in this let's play. I've, I'll have to admit, I'm pretty happy with how it's going so far. I mean, besides losing episode 29, everything's been going pretty smoothly for my first Let's Play. I'm really excited to be doing this, even though I'm not getting many reviews and I'm not really popular. It's not really why I did it. There's a bug over there, by the way. It's not really why I did it. I just did it for the fun of it, you know? Oh, that's not a bug. That's a Poe. Um... And I'm just glad I'm able to record this. I'm able to do it. And I hope to keep doing it. I mean, I have, like, lots of plans um, for Let's Plays, including Kingdom Hearts, which I might do at one point, maybe. Um, I'm kind of waiting for 2.5 to come out, so that way I can play all the games. That just formed a human. Um, a couple Zelda games I wouldn't mind doing, and just, just stuff like that, and I'm really excited to be doing it. Um, I wanted this one as my first one because, like, I guess I can explain that later. It's not really that important, but, like, like I'm just really like happy to be doing this uh because i've been wanting to do it for a while i have so much inspiration from people like chuck conroy and then nintendo capri sun and i'm just overjoyed i just gotta get better at editing because when i play rpgs things just go amok oh you were expecting me old man and that's your link is it and that's right dude your eyes are huge <laughs> Maybe. Or am I mistaken? You're not mistaken. Oh crap, I forgot to do something before I came here. Dim the road leading desert is impassable. The desert of world's in is still the mercy. Oh, these old bones in your freaking eyes. Jeez, dude. Don't tell me you plan to enter this. I do. Oh, this is uh, crap. I think I'm gonna need rupees. I'm probably gonna need rupees. That's good. This is gonna hurt. No, it's not. If I do need rupees, I will uh, be able to get them because I think the bug I got, I didn't check. I think it's the other dragonfly, so I should be able to get 100 rupees. No? Wait. Oh, it wasn't a bug. <laughs> right. Oh, gosh. I'm losing it. Let's just dive. Yeah, I'm, like, glad I'm doing this. I enjoy recording. I enjoy posting. It's, um, I just get really busy. and Sometimes you just can't post every day, you know? I enjoy doing it. It's something I want to keep doing. Um, and who knows? Maybe one day I'll get popular. Maybe I won't. I honestly don't really care. If I can get at least one view on a video, whether it's just my friends or just some person, and it, they watch it or something, you know, um, I'm overjoyed because I'm able to give them something. I see a Poe over there. I'm going to go do that real quick. If I need rupees, I I can do this later. But um, I'm going to go. 
can I do this yet? I might have to... You might have to actually do the, the cuckoo thing at night. Alright. I'm not going to worry about it then, because I don't have any money. <laughs> if I had to go get rupees, though, I'm going to have to go do what I was going to do earlier. Alright, buddy. Hey, buddy. Hmm. Uh, like, there you go. I see. Uh, this time's all paid for. So what do you say? You want to go? Go. Because luckily, after we do what I'm about to do, we won't have to worry about taking this. Oh, it's really cold in this room. I need to turn off the fan. You can hear me moving. Oh. Man, I've been sitting for a while. My legs are kind of wobbly. Ugh. All right. So we're taking an Oasis flight over to it. there. Well, that's convenient. You look shy. Before we go on, there's something I want you to hear. Do you remember what the spirit said about the few shadow up? I do, but none of you do. What do you think happened to the magic wielders who tried to rule the sacred realm? They were banished. They were chased across the sacred lands of Hyrule and driven into another realm by the goddess. This is... Uh oh, cutscene time. I better not lose this video. There's another world entirely. I don't know how to say that. The antithesis of Hyrule, where the sun shines bright. Become shadows. I can't breed half these things. Eventually, most came to call it the Twilight Realm, and from it, none could return to the world of light. Except me. They were forever doomed to live in the twilight, fitting in the half-light of dusk, mere shadows of Hyrule. And you know all this because... This is the history of the Twilight, as it has been passed down from our ancestors. Oh, so you're a Twilight person. Do you not understand what, I'm, what I am? I am a descendant of the tribe that was banished to the Twilight Realm. So you're one of the... It was a peaceful place... Until Zant took control of the Twilight Realm and transformed all the Twilight into Shadow Beasts. You mean I've been killing your people, basically? We haven't seen any of those cool mask ones. Those two, on the left and right. It's clear to me now that he somehow gained a great evil power previously unknown to our tribe. In any case, I, I was sent from there. And can no longer get into the Twilight Realm without his power. There's another tale told by my people. Though the goddesses forbade us to return to the world of light, they left one link between the light and the darkness. Something called the Mirror of Twilight was passed to the protectors of Hyrule. It's our only path to the Twilight Realm. And we must get there. Oh! You'll come with me, won't you? That's cute. Alright, so we got some things done in this video. Um, I think it's a good place to stop for now. Um, if you can see off there in a the distance, that's kind of important. But... There's something I want to go over, which I'm going to do in the next part because I'm at uh, 14 minutes, nearly 15. First of all, listen to this freaking music. It's freaking amazing. Was there something I want to go over that I heard about um, at one point before we continue on in the next episode? So, in the next part, we're going to go through the Gerudo Desert and try to find the Mirror Twilight. See you guys then.